Jenny, I just said, and all I've said to translate it, hi. <laughs> she didn't miss much. <laughs> I really, uh, I said I, I, I'm honored to be here. I, uh, I'm honored to be around people of the, of this, uh, of the calibers, the greatness of, that surrounds me here. I, I'm really humbled by it. I don't deserve this, but uh, here I am, so I have to say something. Right? I uh, was born in Curve Lake First Nation. Uh, I kind of hung around with the old people for quite some time. That's my claim to fame. But what was interesting about it is that they told me some of the oral stories. Some of the old, 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 old oral stories from way back when. And it's, it always amazed me how much they remember and how far back they remember. Uh, but I also teach at the university level. Right? And I always say that the way the university learns is by accumulated knowledge of books. And books always, the problem with books is that they give us the license to forget. In the oral story, we can't forget. We repeat, repeatedly tell story. So, some of the old, old stories I was really curious about as to my own background. And I, uh, it's only came about maybe 40, 40, 50 years ago that we were kind of seeking out our clans and our names and, and this kind of stuff. And it's beautiful to watch. But the old people that I hung around with predicted this. Right? They, they would say things like to me, well, this is what's going to happen. This is what the history of what you see happening right now is going to change and that it's going to be the young ones who are going to change it and you'll watch it. So one of the basic things we do today is to put tobacco down, right? And I saw how that has evolved over time. It's really kind of interesting to watch. 